is going on all the YouTubers, this is CodeAsian10 and welcome to episode 2 of Coding with Code. And today I'm going to show you how to change the font color of a bat file. So what you want to do is you want to create a bat file and have it ready here. Uh, as you can see I've got my matrix bat file ready here. What you want to do is you just want to open it up and as you can see all the color and all the size and all that kind of stuff is on its default settings. So what you want to do is you want to come up here to where it says C Windows System 33 and all that. You want to right click up there, click onto properties, and as you can see, we've got the options, we've got the font, we've got the layout, and we've got the color. So you can change the color for just about everything on here. Uh, this, I'm just going to show you what you can actually do. As you can see, it's on screen background at the moment. You can change the background color to blue. As you can see, it's blue there. Click on OK, and it will turn it into blue but I'm not going to have it on blue because it looks awful, so I'm going to put it back onto black. Uh, you can, as you can see, it's changed it back to black there. And you can also change the text, the uh, screen text here. You want to click on that. Uh, click a particular color that you like. Uh, I'm going to click on green, and as you can see, it changed back to green. There we go. It's changed it all back there. On the properties. Uh, we can also change the layout, so we can make it wider and longer, all that kind of stuff. So I'm just going to make it a little bit um, longer on its width. Yeah, that's good. And I'm go also going to change the font. So, yeah, you just click on the font and then you uh, just click on one of these. As you can see, this little window kind of gives an example of what it's going to look like. Uh, that looks horrible. That, nah, not really. That one I kind of like. So, yeah, as you can see, it's changed it. And, whoa, that's a bit glitchy. And you just put it onto full screen, and there we go. It's all changed. So, yeah, that's how you change the color, uh, the font size, and the actual size of the bat file itself in the properties. If you want to know how I, sh how I made uh, this matrix look alike, then click on the link that should be on screen around about now. If not, it's going to be in the description. And it will take you to episode one where I show you how to create the matrix very simply and very easily. So yeah, I hope this tutorial was helpful. If it was, then please leave a like down below and hit that subscribe button as it really does help me out a lot. So uh, yeah, thanks a lot. Uh, thanks for watching and uh, see you later, YouTubers.